I want to be very clear about this. I want this to be a place where people feel welcomed. I want to create an environment where people feel welcome to RP whatever they want with me. And I never want to have to question myself and I don't want other people to have to question doing something in RP because of fans or because of OC hate or because of anything else. Um, whether that's like on the, the good side of being like too invested in like, you know, hounding people or on the other side of, um, ugh, I wasn't paying attention, um, on the other side of sending hate. So um, please, please, please keep that in mind with all this stuff because, you know, Lottie, she is, she is a sweet character and, but is also socially, she is not a normal person. She does not see the world like you or I see the world and is therefore going to come up with like, you know, some wild takes sometimes or some logical takes sometimes or like have feelings about things. And I would say like, she also has such a, a weird history that certain things are gonna matter to her and certain things aren't. For the cop stuff, if you don't have anything on you and you're just in the area, that's not enough to get arrested. Yeah, I, I don't know. So that's not, that's not really something that she is thinking about with, you know, like that he was worried about getting caught or whatever with the cops. That's, that's just from her point of view. Um, and because this was the second time in a row, the first time it was kind of like, ah, okay, whatever. The second time I was like, okay, this is a pattern. You know, maybe we don't trust, you know, that much that he actually like cares about us kind of thing. You also have to keep in mind that Lottie already is very sketched out with, you know, because she cared too much about him and is trying to back off of that. The thing with, like, you know as well that Lottie has noticed is that he doesn't really like to talk about things. He already kind of got scared off when she was talking about things. So she is trying to be, like, sensitive. Aww. He left the, he left the bullet. Yeah, and that's the other thing too, like, um, a lot of what Lottie is doing, it feels like, is kind of um hit with a wall in terms of like trying to make a solid friendship with him right and the way that she communicates is different than the way that he communicates right he has been there a lot for her in 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 times where she has needed it but in the way that she communicates her care um it's different than his i i what i see from an ooc perspective is that he communicates by being there for people when they need it, right? And by being uh, being useful to them. Um, for Lottie, she is there by talking, by giving gifts, by also being there for people, you know, you know was getting close to being important to her. And she backed off of that because she was scared of what happened with Luciano. Um, he won't go to jail for such a low level crime job. Well, that's the thing, like she doesn't, she didn't really think that there's much way that he could go to jail, you know? Like um, she didn't think there was that much risk for him. And again, this is what she is seeing. Um, and it also is for, for her right now, she is just getting over Luciano basically like Kind of confirming her fears a little bit that you know she is going to be abandoned by people that she cares about things with luciano are getting better right but she is still in this mindset that she needs to be really really careful who she actually puts stock into and you know was getting close to there and she pulled back and now it's kind of reaffirming that that is the right thing to do for her.